Hi, for this recording, I will show you how to solve the inequality absolute value of x minus 3 less than or equal to absolute value of x plus 2. Now, since both numbers on the inequality are positive, therefore, if you square both sides, the inequality will still remain. That means absolute value of x minus 3 square or still less than or equal to absolute value of x plus 2 square. Now, absolute value of x minus 3 Square is the same as absolute value of is same as x minus 3 square without absolute value. And um, absolute value of x plus 2 square is the same as x plus 2 square without absolute value. And now when you square both sides, this means that x square minus 6x plus 9 on the left hand side is less than or equal to x square plus 4x plus 4 on the right hand side. Note that you have to be careful because we know that x minus 3 square is not equal to x square minus 3 square, all right? You have to be careful about that. Now, because both terms have x square on the... Both sides have x square, you can cancel them. And now I solve this inequality by bringing all the x together. So if I bring all the x together, on the right-hand side, I get 9 minus 4 is less than or equal to 4x plus 6x, which is the same as 5 less than or equal to 10x, or x greater than 5 over 10, which is 0 0.5. Therefore, the solution in this case is the set of interval from 0 0.5, including 0 0.5 to infinity. Now I can show you how I call my calculator class pack to solve this inequality. So let me launch my class pack. Now the class pack, in this case, I'm in the main program. I'm, the usual way you, you see your class pack is actually the maneuvers. Then I launch the main program. And I want to key in the command, absolute value. So I'm going to press the keyboard. And inside the keyboard, let me bring out the LCD screen. You can see color. And I want to key in the absolute value I solve inequality. I press calculus, then solve. And absolute value. So I'm going to use the go back to here. I have uh, x minus 3 square, x minus 3 square, or I use a line form x minus 3 square move the cursor down less than or equal to let me go to advance option less than or equal to x plus 2 square so I move back here x plus 2 Square. Then close the bracket, move the cursor away and close the bracket. Press the e, e button, then it show me the answer is x greater than or equal to 0 0.5. This will end the solution of this solving inequality.